turned out part of the racial slur. Put up on the television when he walked in his room at the Motel 6 on Halk Road in Sharonville. But you can imagine the shock when he saw it. I turned the TV on, laid back on the bed, and when I laid back on the bed, I just happened to do like that. I saw something on the screen, I was like, ah, right, that ain't there. So then I focused my eyes and I couldn't believe what was on there. After he saw the message, Ross called the corporate office. Ross says he was told he'd receive a response to the issue within 30 days. That's when he got in touch with the president of the Dayton chapter of the NAACP. To my amazement, uh, I actually witnessed with my own eyes. Hello, <laughs> exclamation point. Ross is in the area to attend the Macy's Music Festival, a predominantly African-American event. Forward thinks the timing of the message is no coincidence, and he has a message for the motel's corporate office. For a guest to come to your hotel, turn on the TV during a Macy's Jazz Festival that's predominantly African-American, that attend this event, to say, hello, what kind of welcome is that? Ma'am, are, are you willing to talk to me about this? Soon after the motel found out about our camera being in the room, we were forced to leave the building. Managers wouldn't comment on the situation and even threatened to remove Ross from his room. And as far as we know, that message was only in that one room. And late tonight, we heard from Ross. He says the motel did give him a new room, and we tried to get comment from Motel 6's corporate office. And so far, they have not returned our phone call. Bye.